welcome back in ibps sof for mains 2021 to 2022 there was a question related to urihaline organisms so this video is all about urihaline and stenohaline organisms well this urihaline and stenohaline organisms comes under aquatic organisms well what is urihaline organisms those which can tolerate wide range of salinity comes under urihaline organisms which means urihaline organisms can live in water with any range of salinity this organisms can live in fresh water brackish water or salt water has they have the capacity to tolerate wide range of salinity example of urihaline fishes salmon and this urihaline organisms comes under osmoconformers where they have the capacity to match the body fluids in osmotic balance with environment so they can tolerate any range of salinity well now let me tell you what is stenohaline organisms the stenohaline organisms can survive only at a narrow range of salinity that is this organisms cannot tolerate wide fluctuations in the salinity of the water for example goldfish which is a freshwater fish can live in fresh water but it dies in high salinity water such as sea water and here some stenohaline organisms which can live in salt water cannot live in fresh water which means stenohaline organisms cannot live in varying salinity levels of water it can stick only to a constant level those living in fresh water cannot able to tolerate under salt water and those living in sea water cannot tolerate under fresh water and thus stenohaline organisms comes under osmoregulators osmoregulators or organisms which maintain a constant internal osmotic condition without balancing with the environment which means even the change in external environment osmoregulators maintain constant osmotic condition of body fluids and that's all for today hope you like this video do subscribe to my channel if you're watching for the first time and don't forget to hit the bell icon too you can also join to my telegram channel where you will get live afo quiz at 8:30 pm daily and that's all for today thank you